Hey guys, welcome to Pitch Preview, where we discuss all the latest football news straight from the source. This Saturday, we have an exciting clash on our hands as title hopefuls Arsenal welcome Brighton to the Emirates Stadium in a battle of the 100% records. Both teams have started the 2024 or 25 Premier League season strong, winning their first two matches. Brighton kicked off their campaign with an emphatic win against Everton and followed it up with a hard-fought victory over Manchester United, thanks to Joao Pedro's late header. Meanwhile, Arsenal secured a comfortable win over Wolves before claiming an important victory at Aston Villa. Mikel Arteta's gunners are gunning for title glory this season, and a strong start will be crucial given the tough schedule they face early on. This upcoming match against a rejuvenated Brighton side will be a true test of their mettle. Brighton's new manager, Fabian Herzler, who is now the second youngest Premier League manager in history, has made an impressive start on the South Coast. However, the Seagulls will face their toughest challenge yet when they visit the Emirates this weekend. Arsenal manager Mikel Arteta has provided some crucial updates on the fitness of new signing Mikel Marino and forward Gabriel Jesus ahead of the match against Brighton. Marino, who just completed his transfer from Real Sociedad earlier this week, was set to make his debut on Saturday. Unfortunately, during his first training session, he sustained a shoulder injury following a collision with defender Gabriel Magalhães. Arteta shared his disappointment, stating, Yes, very unfortunate. Yesterday he had a collision and he has a shoulder injury, unfortunately. It looks like he's going to be out for a few weeks. He was really excited and everything was looking really good. On a brighter note, Arteta sounded optimistic about Gabriel Jesus' recovery, hinting at a potential return after the international break. He is progressing really well, Arteta said. He had a little muscle injury and he is doing quite a lot already, so we expect him to be with us pretty soon. As for Takahiro Tomiyasu, his return to action remains uncertain. The Japanese international has been sidelined with a knee injury since July, and Arteta confirmed that Tomiyasu has yet to resume training. What are your thoughts on Arsenal's chances this weekend? Will Brighton be able to maintain their perfect start? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe to the Pitch Preview for more updates.